Hello friends, I am Ms. Rajesh. Today I am going to show you how to make an assistant application using Thunkable.com. Let's get started. To open Thunkable.com, you have to type Thunkable.com in the internet. I have opened Thunkable.com. Click on Get Started. I am going to start a new project. I am going to name it to assistant. And then click on create. I have created a blank application in thankable.com. The first component I am going to add in thankable is row. This is used for spacing. We have to add a text input box inside this row. Make sure it's inside the row. Then we have to add a button. This button should be over here. I'm going to delete the text in the button. I'm going to change the text color. Color, the background color to transparent and then I'm going to add a background picture I already have a background picture for a mic click on upload face including my image Now the image is added. Then we have to add a web viewer. Web viewer can change. Any web page into our application. We can turn the web page into our application. The last thing we need to add is speech recognizer. It will be added to the invisible components. Let's move on to the box. And then we have to drag the win button one click button. And then in the speech recognizer it has to listen so that we have to drag this in speech recognizer one call listen block and then in this text input one we have to set the text to the value and then from the web viewer one we have to drag the set url block i'm going to text and i'm dragging the join block In google.com, if I search anything, it has this keyword actually, it's not a keyword. We have to copy until the question mark, search question mark. Till this. I have copied this link I'm going to my Thunkable project and then in the place of hello I'm going to type the URL and then in this URL we should add the Q 
and question mark and q and question mark q and equal to this now in the text we have to add this block in text a b c replace all a with b we have to drag this word to the grid right click on the block and select external inputs set the first thing that's in text to the value This is the default thing. We don't need to worry about this. And then we have to type space in this. And then a plus. Let's replace with blocks. We have to add this web viewer inside the speech recognition. That's the whole. Copy paste. This web we are one set you are to block and then now we can collapse this block so that it doesn't disturb the next block. Now we have to add the when text input one submit block and we have to add this with here inside this and then we have to change this value to get text text input one and at last I'm going to change the background color wait a minute we have to expand this block again yes now I'm going to change the background color of the screen in one, we have to select the screen one and then the background color I am choosing blue you can choose any other color too now let's see how our application works friends I am going to show you how our assistant application works let's get started I am opening the Tangabala Assistant application. I am going to search Hello and then submit it. See here, the search Hello in Google. That's good. Thank you. And the important thing about this application is this application only works in smartphones. It doesn't work in a personal computer or laptop. So that's all. Our application is done. Please like, share and subscribe my channel. Thank you.